Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm reviewing the SPY. Really bullish move here for the market today. Recovery after yesterday's fall. I knew that the first five minutes of the day would be the telltale for this. We did, well, actually, we didn't really gap down today. It was more like neutral. Let's just get back to the morning. So <clears throat> we really was a neutral gap today. And I said, if we fall in the first five minutes of the day, we're going to fall and collapse. And if we don't, we're not going to, we're either going to hold or be neutral. I, I didn't think we'd really hold this bullishly. I thought we'd be more neutral, small green, but you know, I mean, we're, we're getting a push here and it's 2.30, only an hour and a half left in the day. And we've retraced more than 50% of the bar from yesterday. Open of yesterday's gap down was 2.38.10. We're within 60 cents of that. We could actually have a big move up into the close where we're doing it right now. It's hard to believe that the market could recover this quickly from this, but not so much because we are very bullish, which I said yesterday in the email and I've been telling people, I said, don't get crazy short in here. Don't think we're gonna pull in. Everyone wants to wait for pullbacks and this and that and the other thing. Could we have pulled in deeper? Yes. Are we going to? No, doesn't look like it. So if we close, I mean, if we close right at this placement right now, it looks like we're gonna rally and carry through higher tomorrow. So, you know, I thought if we held in here, there was a chance we'd fall again one more day, but we are not. We didn't even, actually the, the move we had here into the lunch was barely anything at all. Held 236, basically. So the market's bullish. We shook off yesterday's sell-off, although yesterday was the day to sell off. So look for follow through tomorrow here if we close strong. An hour and a half left of the day, doesn't look like that's not gonna happen. And uh, I'm glad I told people don't get nuts with shorts. And But you can't go right back in long stuff here today, this morning, or early this morning. You needed to know what was gonna happen here, which obviously we're seeing the market is holding. So look for follow through tomorrow, depending on where we get. Um, and the market's just very strong. I knew we'd make another new high. I, I didn't know how soon, but if we make it in the next, if we make it before the end of the month, that would be, you know, extremely bullish. And look, previous high was 240.67. We're not that far off of it. And yesterday, as of yesterday, we were down at 235.75. Market's very strong, people. So be careful. And, you know, that's why you just do a wait and see after a day like yesterday, which had a lot of volatility and was a big sell off day. But, you know, whether continued or not, today was the telltale sign. And apparently, it's not going to, at least not the way we're closing strong today. Ooh, what was that? All right. Good luck, everyone. We'll see what we get tomorrow. Email me at melissa at stockswoosh.com if you would like to sign up for the Golden Gap course. Thanks, everybody. It's this weekend, May 20th and 21st, and the deadline's tomorrow. Thanks.